Excuse me, then. Would you happen to have any rum? No, precious. We don't like it. Hey. Our stupid reactions. Tune in for the. Hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions unit. I'm Corbin. Um, so. And you can follow us on Instagram and Twitter for more juicy. Instagram. Go on. So juicy. It's so juicy. Good luck. Hey, John, follow us on Twitter account. Ring the bell to be tart of you notifications. Go on. <laughs> oh, so good at the Twitter's process. Today, uh, we are reacting to a live performance song. <gasps> Ooh. Uh, it's called. Who is it? Who's singing it? Who's doing it? I don't. know. Can you read the uh, basically the 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 title of the whole all of it? I don't yes. know what any of those words mean. Oh, the whole all of it. What we see first is Malagel, and then we see Tanka Tinkel, Agam Momentos. Uh, and it's it says Tamil and Malayalam as the languages. I don't yeah, know I if it's two language. I was going to say those words didn't seem to be phonetically Hindi. Uh, but this is Harish. I can't say that name. Shivaramakashran uh, is a popular Carnatic musician. For, Not uh, bad. And a frontman for Agam. Agam is a Bangalore based contemporary Carnatic progressive rock band. Oh, that's awesome. The band, wow. was, the band was formed in the year 2003. Cool. I'm all for some rock, man. D but did you combine the words rock and Carnatic? Yeah. Dude. I'm looking forward to it. Never I experienced agree. never experienced that before. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have subs for this part. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Malikani, 
I wish we had subs for that one. Yeah, me too. I, I, I wish we knew what he was singing. I think that would have made a huge, huge difference. Yeah, we didn't have subs. Sorry, guys. Um, but yeah, it's, it was really pretty. It's just obviously uh, they were cheering at times, and I don't know if that's because they just knew what what he was about to sing or what he just sang. But it, it would have been nice to know that if like because it sounded like a really pretty song that I'm sure had beautiful, beautiful lyrics. Um, but yeah, we just, um, so sorry about that. Um, but he looked really, really cool, though. I, I loved his look. Yeah, and I also, I, I, I was, I almost wish I didn't know that they were, quote unquote, rock and roll band. Um, I, I was, I was waiting. I thought the opening of it was like an intro, and I was waiting for the rock and roll song to kick in hmm. and to somehow blend a rock song versus and, and carnatic music they probably have other that are more uh i bet they do style, but yeah the one that the one that i was sent was a uh, um a this one which has almost nine million views um i'm wondering if it's like a um there's a, a lot of times that people sing like almost religious songs uh and that's what it sounded mm-hmm. like like almost like a hymn style uh and it was really pretty he has a, he has a really good voice uh, yeah, he has a beautiful voice. I just, deeply, wish, I, I, you know, I I just wish I knew what he said. Uh, that's that's because uh, this sounds like one of those songs that you really need to appreciate the the the, the lyrics of it um, to really get a to get a feel for. It. I loved it. He had the crazy awesome hair and then the the full sleeve of tats on it both. Uh, yeah, the first time seeing I've seen his tats that, made me I made me want to get more tats. <laughs> I need to get a new tattoo. 
Uh, I know. Too. I so badly want to get some new tattoos. Well, I guess I, I guess it's not the best time. Uh. <laughs> nah. <laughs> not really. Not opening the tattoo parlors just yet, I don't think. Not, I don't think those are essential businesses right now. Sadly, it may not. feel like that to us. <laughs> yeah. Well, let us know more from this uh, this band uh, that kind of like almost blends like the Carnatic and the in the in the rock style because I'm a we're both big fans of like classic rock, Led Zeppelin, and, and all that. Those <laughs> and other. Carnatic music. <laughs> yes. And so if we can yeah. blend those uh, and and see that, I would love to see that. Uh, I think that's one of the areas we haven't explored. It really is Indian rock. We haven't explored it uh, very much at all. I remember, I remember one reaction that we did, mm-hmm. and they were not. They were. Um, I forgot what part of India they were from. It was not a Hindi band. Uh, anyway, yeah, bring, we need. We've done rap and hip hop, but we need. We need. I would love to hear some rock and roll bands from India. That is new. Our stupid reactions. Tune in for.